Hi there, welcome to your mat. Welcome to Anywhere, Anytime Yoga. My name is Ashley, you can call me Ash. I'll be guiding you through a 10 minute sun salutation practice. It's quick, you can do it any time of the day. All you need is your yoga mat and some comfy clothing. So go ahead, get those things ready, and we'll start in a minute. All right, we'll begin in mountain pose. So go ahead and stand nice and tall, lift all your toes, spread them as wide as you can, and then press them back down. Feel your body rooting through the feet, into the mat, into the earth. And then engage your legs, a little bit of core, find length all the way through the spine, the crown of the head, relax your shoulders, turn your palms to face forward, and close your eyes. Take a deep breath in through the nose, and out through the nose. Now this time, deep breath in through the nose, and out through the mouth. Now this time, reach up, inhale, reach high, and exhale through the mouth, hands to heart center. Slowly blink your eyes open. We'll begin with a half sun salutation first. Standing nice and tall, inhale, reach the arms out to the side and all the way up. And as you exhale, hands to heart center, bend your knees, fold over your legs. Inhale, halfway lift, slide your hands up your legs, straighten your legs, give your shoulder blades a little squeeze as you look forward. Exhale to fold, release the head and the hands. Inhale to rise, strong legs, reverse butterfly, reach your arms out to the side and all the way up. Exhale, hands to heart center. Let's do that again. Inhale, reach high. Exhale, hands to heart, bend your knees, stick your sit bones out behind you as you fold over the legs. Inhale, hamstring stretch, halfway lift. Hands to legs, flat back. Exhale to fold. Inhale to stand. And exhale, hands to heart center. All right, let's do a modified sun salutation A. Inhale, reach high. Exhale to fold. Inhale, halfway lift. Exhale to plant your hands and come to a modified plank. So find your tabletop and then walk your knees back a little maybe lift your feet. Take an inhale here, and as you exhale, keep your hips high, lower your chin and your chest. Inhale to cobra, press into the belly, the tops of the feet, and just lift the chest. Exhale, lower down. Inhale, press up to tabletop, and exhale, downward facing dog. Hands are shoulder distance apart, feet are hip distance apart. Maybe you slightly pigeon toe, bringing your heels a little bit out. And then see if you can spin your elbow creases, the part of the elbow that bends up to the ceiling. Externally rotate those shoulders and then bring the majority of your weight into your feet. Take a little bit of pressure out of the wrists. Spread the fingers nice and wide. Take an inhale here, come high to your toes. And then as you exhale, bend your knees, look forward, and walk to the top of your mat, landing in a forward fold. Inhale, halfway lift. Exhale to fold. Inhale to stand, reach up to the ceiling. Exhale, hands to heart center. Let's do that one more time. Inhale, reach high. Exhale to fold over soft knees. Inhale, halfway lift. Little hamstring stretch. Press your hands into your legs. Reach your heart forward as you look forward. Exhale to fold. Plant your hands. Come to that modified plank. Whether you stay in tabletop or whether you walk your knees back a few inches, take an inhale here. And as you exhale, lower your chin and your chest. Inhale, come up to cobra. Lift the chest. Press into the pubic bone and the tops of the feet. Draw the shoulder blades down and back. Exhale to lower. Inhale, press up to tabletop. And then exhale, downward facing dog. Take one deep breath here. Nice slow breath out. Inhale, high to your toes. 
Exhale, bend your knees, look forward and move to the front of your mat, land in a forward fold. Inhale, halfway lift, slide your hands up your legs, so much so that you can create this flat back for yourself. And then exhale to bend the knees and fold. Inhale to stand, reach up to the ceiling. Exhale, hands to heart center. One more time, feel free to try plank from the toes and lowering halfway into upward facing dog. If you're not ready for this, please continue modified sun salutations from the knees. Inhale to reach high. Exhale, soft knees as you fold. Inhale, halfway lift. Hands to legs, gently press into your legs, giving yourself a nice flat back as you look slightly forward. Exhale to fold, plant your hands. Now maybe come to a plank on your toes. Inhale to bring your shoulders forward, maybe past your fingertips. And then exhale, lower halfway for upward facing dog. Come to the tops of your feet. Inhale, lift the chest, lift your thighs, draw your shoulder blades back. And then find your downward facing dog. Lift your hips up and back. Take a deep breath here. And then exhale, let it go. Inhale, high to your toes. Exhale, bend your knees and move forward. Inhale, halfway lift, hands to shins, flat back. Exhale to fold. Inhale to rise, standing tall, reach up to the ceiling. Exhale, hands to heart center. One more time, inhale, reach high. Exhale to fold. Inhale, halfway lift. Exhale, plant your hands and come to your version of a plank. Whether on your knees or your toes, take an inhale here. Exhale, lower, hug those upper arms in. Inhale, cobra or upward dog. Exhale, downward facing dog. Take one deep breath in. Nice slow breath out. Inhale, high to your toes. Exhale, bend your knees and move forward. Inhale, halfway lift. Exhale to fold. Inhale, we rise, standing tall, reach up to the ceiling. Exhale, hands to heart center. We'll finish with sun salutation B, changing it up a little. Bring your big toes together. Leave a small space between your heels. Inhale to reach the arms forward and up to the ceiling, and then exhale, sink into chair pose. Imagine an invisible chair is behind you, and you're about to sit down into it. Now find the weight in your heels. Slightly lift your toes. Take an inhale here. Exhale, forward fold. Inhale, halfway lift. Hands to shins, flat back. Exhale, plant your hands and come to your plank. Inhale, nice and strong. Exhale, chaturanga, lower to your push-up. Inhale to your back bend, cobra or upward dog. Exhale, downward facing dog. Now, right away, let's inhale the right leg up to the ceiling. And then exhale, step your foot between your hands. If it doesn't make it there, you can help it there. Bring your left foot closer, just a little, and lower onto your left heel. Reach the arms up as you come to warrior one. Right knee is bent, left leg is straight. Take an inhale to reach high. Exhale, frame the right foot. Lower your hands. Inhale, come back to a plank. Exhale, lower to your push-up. Inhale to your back bend. Exhale, downward facing dog. Other side, inhale, left leg high. Exhale, try to step your foot between your hands. If it doesn't make it there, you can help it there. Plant your right heel. Keep the left knee bent. Inhale, warrior one. Reach up. Exhale, maybe bend a little deeper. Nice strong right leg. Engage that core. One more breath here. Exhale, frame the left foot. Inhale, step back to plank. Exhale, lower. Chaturanga, find your push-up. Inhale to your back bend, cobra or upward dog. Exhale, downward facing dog. We're almost there. Take a deep breath in and a slow breath out. Inhale, high to your toes. 
Exhale, bend your knees, look forward and travel forward. Inhale, halfway lift. Exhale to fold, keep your knees bent, keep your hips low. Inhale to chair, maybe sweep the arms high. Maybe keep your hands at heart center. Maybe lift your toes, slightly tuck the tailbone. One more breath here, try to find a nice straight spine and then rise, inhale to stand, reach up to the ceiling. Exhale, hands to heart center. Take this moment to pause in mountain pose. Lower your arms down by your sides. Turn your palms to face forward. Close your eyes. Thank you so much for joining me. Take this moment to complete your practice in mountain pose, standing tall, feeling energized. Or if you'd like to sit down, you can always come to easy pose. Find yourself cross-legged. Maybe bring a mudra into your hands, pointer fingers and thumbs to touch, and then rest your hands on your lap. If you prefer hands at heart center, if you prefer Shavasana, excuse me, you can go ahead and lay down. If you'd like a minute or two of rest, take this time to come to stillness. It is so important for our bodies to rest after movement, even if it's just for a minute or two, to get that heart rate down for our bodies to absorb all of the benefits of everything we just did. So I will play a minute or two of some soft, calming music. You may lay in Shavasana, stand in mountain pose, or come to easy pose. Close your eyes, and as the music fades out, you will know when your time is up. Thank you so much for watching. Like this video, leave me a comment below. Feel free to subscribe anywhere, anytime yoga. My name is Ashley. Thank you so much. Namaste.